Hello everybody. I thought that I would talk outside today because number one, it is a beautiful day. Number two, I'm taking a break, which I never do. Historically, I just work, work, work and go, go, go as good as I can all day. Chuck down lunch in five minutes, but I am trying to learn how to walk away and give myself 10 or 15 minutes of a break. So, on my break today, decided to come outside and breathe fresh air. It's weird. Um, and talk to you for just a second and say a couple of things. So this weekend, I went camping with my friends and I actually have been very blessed in this last year with a little group of friends who are very supportive and understanding and participate with me and all of my whatever. Uh, me and Water Lily for that matter. And an example of that would be our time together camping this weekend where I spent a lot of time not doing anything, sitting, napping, getting up, and hanging out. And I did not feel bad for it, nor did they make me feel bad for it. In fact, they were very encouraging and sweet about it, um, as they always are. As important as it is for those of us with um, any kind of chronic illness, in addition to autoimmune, in particular thyroid, uh, just because most people that have that disease have a chronic issue, like their chronic illness, a feeling like they can't speak their mind or what they're really thinking, what they're really feeling, nobody really wants to hear it, right? So that we keep it all inside and it relates back to the thyroid, you know, your words getting choked up in your throat. So um, as much as it is important for us to be heard and for people to give us a break, I think it's equally as important to not compliment, Acknowledge, acknowledge when you have a good support group. Acknowledge your friends, your family, your husband, your mom, your dad, your whoever, and give credit where credit is due. We have a heavy load on our shoulders, sure. We are asking for help and support from other people, but that also means that they're having to give of themselves to support us. So if that makes sense, I really just kind of want to say, number one, I've got a really great group of friends who are being incredibly supportive to me right now as I learn and transition and speak up and speak out and deal with all of the changes that I'm making, which is just, you know, another kind of stress and another thing to take on. Um, I would say that probably out of my support group, my husband is my biggest, biggest support um, he has tried to educate himself a little bit. He's given me an open door to talk, discuss, whine, cry, whatever. Um, since I've been saying that I don't feel good and that I need to take a break, he hasn't made me feel bad about it once. He hasn't questioned me or pushed me. He has just simply said, okay. And that has really brought me a sense of freedom and love, right? And I will tell you that he is the person in our house that cooks. So as I start this new way of eating on the AIP autoimmune paleo protocol, if it weren't for him, I would have dumped it and went to Chick-fil-A because I don't like to cook. And it's hard to think and remember and to do. And I, usually I only have like five minutes to figure out what I'm eating and another five minutes to choke it down, like I said. So without his support, I wouldn't have made it my first week, my first day, much less the next, I don't know, 90 days minus one week. So this is week two. So anyway, I just wanted to give a shout out to those people. And I also wanted to remind those of us who are struggling with these things to say thank you and to put into words our gratitude like we're trying to put into words all of our other thoughts and feelings and all of our challenges um, when we hurt and when we don't feel good and when we're tired and and all of those things we need to say thank you 
And that would include, I think, our medical professionals who are supporting us. If you have a good doctor, a good um, natural doctor, a good massage therapist, a good nutritionist, a good whatever, let them know. We need it. They need it. Everybody needs it, right? A little more love in the world. I hope everyone's having a great day.